So this weekend we camped at Two Rivers Campground and Boat Ramp. I think some places it says uh, Two Rivers RV Park. But anyways, with the number two and not um, not the letter to or TWO, it's the number two. Because if not, that pulls up a different campground. This is just right outside of Benton, Tennessee. And uh, this is, was a wonderful park, and I just wanted to share it with you. And I'm going to take you through the campground and show you some more things about it. But this was a really nice campground. It's right on the rivers, the Hawassi River and the Okoe River. It's where the Okoe actually comes into the Hawassi, and it's, it's great. But I'll, I'll take you around and show you a few things. This is one of the tent sites. Uh, this is number 10. But anyway, each tent site has a picnic table. It's got a fire ring in it. And it also has water and power. So in a nice flat level, it's really neat. And this is the Hawassi River. There's a boat out there fishing now. So uh, this is just one of the tent sites. And I think there's, I don't know how many's here, eight or nine or 10. And uh, it's, it's pretty neat. And the bathhouse is just right up the hill above the tent sites. We'll go look at the bathhouse. Okay, this is the bathhouse, and uh, I was going to take you guys and walk you through it. There's somebody in the ladies' bathroom, so I'm not taking you in there. I don't feel like getting slapped or beat. So here it is. Got sinks, and I think it's really neat and clean. Like I said, I can't say anything about for the women's side, but it's got two showers. Looks like three toilets. We'll take a look at the toilet. So I think it's great. And you got power receptacles. So here's the boat ramp. It's a nice boat ramp. Easy to back in. And what's, what's great about this place, the location, is like I said, that's the Hiawassee River on this side coming down. And this is where the Okoe River dumps out into, whoa, that's slick, about fell. This is, <laughs> boat ramp slick. So this is where the Okoe River spills out into the Hiawassee. And both rivers are very clear. So man, this is it's a pretty, pretty area. And when we put in at the Okoe Dam and floated down, it took us five hours to get to the park. And it was just beautiful all the way. The, the rocks on the side of the banks and the fish you could see because the water's so clear. It was nice, really nice. And it took five hours to get from the Okoe Dam to the RV park here. So there's the tent camping. That's where it ends. Right here's the boat ramp. Then this is where the RV spots start. They have 50 amp and 30 amps. There's not room at your spot to park your boat or trailer. So anyway, they have an area designated here where you can park those. So this is our spot. And the RV spots, every one of them has a sewer hookup. I really like that. And they have a 30 amp receptacle on most of the RV ones. These spots are $30 a night. Some of the other ones have 50 amp receptacles and they're $35 a night. So this is our area and I'll take you right past it to where we're at on the river. That's the wife, she's tidying up because we're going home today. So behind the spots, most spots, You've got a level area down here that's really neat. We set our picnic table and our grill up, as you can see. And this is the El Coe. Now, when you call to make reservations here, you can't give them your credit card number over the phone or anything like that. What you have to do here is you have to write a check and mail them a deposit in. So that's it's a little old-fashioned. But this is a really neat campground. And another thing, they did not bother us. There's, they just let you camp and let you be. So I really did like it. And the garbage pickup, every campsite's got a, a garbage can. And they pick those up daily, empty their trash. So it was a really neat, 
neat experience here. I, like I said, I will be back, and I, I really recommend it.